everyone, welcome back to Chibimi's tutorial video. Uh, you know, I have received a lot of requests on how to blend color. So, in this video, I'll share with you three ways you can use to do that, along with the brushes and uh, basic applications for that. Okay, um, this is the first brush. You can set it by pressing F5 and I'll use two colors according to skin tones like like this. Um, you see, when I set up the brush, yeah, that is my setup of brush, I leave transfer at 0%. To have a brush with transparency, you'll be like this. The transparency of the brush will create, you know, like the intermediate colors we have to connect, like two colors. I have chosen before smoothly. It's not too difficult, right? Now I'll apply that on face skin. So I'm sketching a a, a basic face. Um, I'll use the first color as a background and for the second for the second uh, color I'm doing the same and then you see I um, kind of blend the colors. Done. You see, two parts of skin color have been blended. Okay, let's move to the second way, which I prefer to use. Okay, so here I'll use a different skin tone. And um. Yeah, there's like two skin tone I use, a bit different from the last one. So this time, we'll change the brush setting a bit. I'll move the hardness section to 0%. And you see, doing this way, it is easy and like saves time as well. And we will continue to apply that on the face skin Okay, and next is a third way, and this time I use another skin tone. I 
a bit more like brown. And uh, this time I'm using the sponge tool instead of brush. Smudge, smudge tool, yeah, whatever. And the difficult thing about using this method is that you, that you know, it would be difficult to manage, like block, uh, creation. But when you get used to it, you can find it really convenient. Um, let's see how I apply it. Okay, so uh, basically the three ways I've already shown you is quite similar, like they will give quite similar results, but it's just like three different ways to do it. And using which method depends on each person and even the combination of the three ways is possible. And I'll do it with the hair. Uh, it's like quite the same with the hair. This is the, the first the first way. It's the first way I do with the hair. Um, this is the second way. I'm kind of like combining different ways to do with the hair. And in here, I'm using the third way. That is the end of uh, today's tutorial video. Thank you for watching the video and I hope that you find this video useful for you. And don't forget to like the video, subscribe to my channel and I'll be back soon with my next video about how to draw skin. Uh, like detailed instructions on how to draw skin. Thank you. Bye.